What up, as man, dems, man, dems, what up, hello, and assalam alaikum. Welcome back to Rama Vlogs 2018. Today, we are commencing rolls at 26, and I don't know what to eat. Shocker! Right, I actually don't know what to eat. I think I might just go for a wheat bit because I know there's lots of food left over, but I don't feel uh, I don't feel like I can eat anything heavy right about now. Do you know when you like you just want something light, you want something refreshing, but you don't want it to be like you don't want chicken and jutney at like quarter past two in the night in the morning. I mean, like. Wait a bit, it is then me! Does anybody else have these plastic containers? I'm gonna go for three wheat a bit this morning. I have a gorilla pod, which I have attached to my camera, but like during Sahari, I use this. This is my tripod. Voila! Perfect height, man. Guys, yesterday I forgot to take my hair fever tablet, man. I rushed to close what I was that and I completely forgot about it. <laughs> Can't do that today, mate. My nose is all gone. I actually ran out of tablets, so they on my final four. Well, final three now. So apparently I found out today that Taking the nasal spray, you know the nasal spray for your nose and the sinus and all the hair fuel business is actually okay during Ramadan. I didn't know that, but is it okay? What 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 are your thoughts guys? Comment down below. Do you guys take the nasal sprays? <laughs> Do you have hair fever? Because like, not everyone suffers from it. Oh, oh I'm exhausted. Oh, oh, oh. I keep, I keep, oh, oh I'm so tired. Okay squad, I'm gonna sign out for tonight. I've read Namaz. I've well I've had a wee of bits of clothes well, I'm closing my rosa. And I'm so tired, I need to get to sleep. It's like quarter to three. I need to be open a few hours. I, I, will, I think that it gets to a certain part of the night and that's in my brain doesn't want to uh, deliver conversations in good English. I think it just needs to just say words and try and make them make sense. Right, so I'm gonna go sleep now. Uh, I shall catch you guys tomorrow, well, in the next clip. Good night and Shabbat Oh my God, today has to be one of the hottest days we've had to join Ramadan. Oh guys, I don't know if you guys can see me, but I am so dehydrated, I am. I li I'm literally feeling the rosa today. I'm feeling it because I feel like it's really warm. I can't breathe. But also, I feel really dehydrated and I feel that my, uh, oh god, don't you fly away, I need you. And I feel that I'm struggling to like, keep it together. <laughs> like in, in work, I was just kind of like, it's really warm and I'm in like shorts right now. And I was actually in a t-shirt like this as well, but, oof, oof. Imagine how the people feel that live in third world countries and the weather's like this continuous, continuously. Oof, can't kind of speak, right, let's go. So the thing is, right. We're in the hospital, visiting. I've lived in Leeds all my life. I've never been to this part of the hospital. I mean, it is St. James Hospital where I was born. Thank you very much. But, never. Just going shopping, really. Is it, is it a hospital or, oh, that one's been sold. Is it an art gallery? Guys, might just start playing a bit of piano. Natural, natural. I feel like I spend most of my time in Sainsbury's. I've been here today already. I was there the other day, but I know I'm here. And hang on, I need, <laughs> I need a basket. I know I'm here, but I really do like Aldi. I prefer Aldi's, man. Cheap, cheerful, and you know what? Everything tastes good, man. Everything is, is pretty spot on. All right, guys, so I've had to write a rap. I've not actually mentioned this. I've actually got um, an audition tomorrow. I'm going to Leicester. Um, I've got to write a rap, man. Yeah, here it goes. Okay, let me just spit it right now. I'm not a rapper, but let's go. Hooligans. These guys call me Packy, they need to go school again. Discriminating me against my colour, that's cool, I guess. That's all I got. 
say it right, listen, this is why I like Aldi. Sweet potato fries, right here, they're £2.30. In Aldi's, they're £1.20. Fam, why? These are the cookies, and we'll put that in the, on the list. The list is ever growing. I'm pretty sure they're on the list. You know what, guys? All I gotta say, patience. You got to have patience when dealing with situations. I'm a great job. The only reason I came to Sainsbury was to get the sauce for the burgers, and I completely forgot. So, but to come all the way back, got it. Burger sauce. Just a few minutes before Rosa opens. Make sure you do either way. And make sure you appreciate everything that's laid in front of you. Yes, it'll be given. I felt that this rosa has been really tricky on me. I feel like heat has really got with me and because I can't breathe, I really struggled. But you know what guys, it's about understanding and knowing <laughs> you know how lucky we have it because we like I said earlier that in third world countries they deal with this type of weather constantly. They have this weather all year round, you know, they don't have water, they don't have clean, fresh drinking water. They like when we go get ready to read the mouth, we can do gully uh, Chaluti with with fresh cold tap water, which is, you know, there's, there's no diseases. It's clean. It's pure. It's it's refreshing. People don't have that, man. People don't have that. People have got to walk miles to a well to pull out a bucket to you know pull up dirty water, man. We have it so well off. And today reminded me of that again. And no, no, these this. The like Ramadan does it a lot and puts things in perspective and genuinely today I feel so blessed because I've opened my rosa and I'm I'm happy I've drank lots of cool that's the first thing I did I had my kajur I had two glasses of pani man and I was like yo I need it I'm dehydrated it puts things in perspective that's all I gotta say man it puts things in perspective and um, yeah man I'm just Let's spend the next couple of days because Ramadan is coming to an end. Let's really, really make the most of it. Really appreciate and thank Allah for what we have. And um, think of others and pray for others in Syria, in Yemen, everywhere where there's problems going off, bombs going off. You know, we have it so well. Like, we've got a nice comfy bed. We've got nice clothes in our wardrobe. We have a computer. We have a phone, whatever it is. You know, Alhamdulillah. Just say Alhamdulillah guys, Alhamdulillah. Right guys, I'm gonna end the vlog there. I need to I need to actually edit the vlog. I'm running really late today because I gotta go drive it. And tonight tonight, well we will be commencing the 27th Ro Rosa, which you guys know what that means. It could potentially be Lail al Qadr. So man's in a rush, man needs to do his praying, his du'as, his you know, and, and just really reflect. So guys, thank you so much for watching. I shall catch you guys tomorrow. If you like this video, make sure you hit notifications, make sure you subscribe, and please do add me on Instagram and Snapchat. Before I go, big shout out to Mazamandes because we are sick, we have fun, and we take life as it comes. Catch you tomorrow, guys. Goodbye.